Hello everyone, welcome back to Skyrim Special Edition. Two chain, two things have changed since last time. I, uh, what are they doing over there? That's Belrand. I changed the game back to Legendary because of my indecisiveness. And <laughs> Belrand's actually going for a swim this time. Um, I think Legendary is more challenging. Um, I noticed that uh, on lower levels there's no challenge at all actually for me. I'm a little bit weaker than my followers, but I take that for granted. Um, I guess only the deadly bosses are real tough, but as soon as... Uh, in moments where I got three or more followers, I should just put it on legendary. So yeah, that changed, and the second one is that I uh, took out the Climate of Tamriel Winter Edition and uh, put it back to normal, so there's less snow uh, and it just goes back to what it's supposed to be. So that's it, and also Vorsak is taking a swim, and we are going to clear the Draugr from Reachcliff Cave. That's what we are going to do. So we are on our way there. Yay, going through a waterfall. Wouldn't be that gay in real life with this uh, temperature. And that's a crab, let's avoid it. How do we get the hell out of this water? What is that thing? It's just, a, just a root. Ooh. Some kind of Chinese bridge. Japanese design. Okay, what are we dealing with? A slaughterfish? Yeah, I think I think a slaughterfish or a crab. All right. Um, where is our map marker? It's over there. I'm actually going to take a look at this bridge. Have I been here before? I don't think so. No, probably not. So let's take a quick look. See if we can find something interesting. Among... There's company all the way back there. Although I think... Those are my followers, right? Uh, turning around is not good for my uh, performance issues. They are always full of tools and hoes. Those hoes are a real pain to use. Never again will I do an honest day's work. Not sure, it might be Borgak who's fighting there. Other than the great architecture and the great sound effects, I'm not sure what bug that does. Uh, there's nothing to see in these, uh, or within those bridges. Crabs everywhere in this watery area. Alright, I'll let him fight on. He's fighting a goat. <laughs> Are you fighting a goat right now? No, still, it's still a crab. Alright, let's 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 leave it. Leave him, leave her, whatever. And let's uh, focus on getting our ass to Redcliffe Cave. Now, how the hell do we get up there? Probably by uh, following the road a little bit. There's no really a straight line up here. So the grasses are back. The snow is gone, which makes the snow sections all the more special, I guess. The aurora is bright, it's 4 a.m. It is snowing though. <laughs> Alright, let's keep on following the road. That might be it. A tower on top of it. Actually, it look, looks like a little bit of a, um, a dwarven tower. Yeah. Who knows? Reachcliff Cave, we've discovered it. Although the dwarven structures are mostly near Morrowind. Mostly. There's the entrance to the left. Those could be hostiles, but maybe not. I guess we should try. There's a cave here. Think we should check it out? She's no hostile. 
The Draugr infesting the Mirror Sanctuary are inside. Wait a second, is this a, a full quest? Eola, are you a companion? I could use a hand. I could always use a hand. I was hoping you would say that. Glad you're on the team. Um, she might be a little more fragile than the rest of my followers, though. Legendary could kill her, although it makes her damage and damage taken maybe also legendary. So let's have a quick look. Eola, yeah, she does look a bit like a companion. It seems like we've met her before. Um... Yeah, the taste of death. Eola and Markarth wants me to join her in worshipping Namira, the Lady of Decay, by feasting on the flesh of the dead. Wait a second, that's no companion. She has something planned inside Beechcliff Cave. Um, I'm trying to think. Did we meet her at the uh, the Hall of the Dead? I think we did, but I kind of remember also meeting a guy there who wants me to do something similar. She has something planned. All right, all right, cool, sure. Let's uh, let's take it on then. How are you doing? Lead the way. We're leading the way? Alright. She looks a bit freaky with her left eye. What else? She's quite attractive. Not sure about her personality though. It's more important. Um, yeah, let's dive in. Love this track. And the track is gone, though. Children creep me out. Is it just me, or do they all look the same? <laughs> if we had kids, what do you suppose they would look like? I don't know. Oh no, I meant hypothetically. Not that I would want to. Although you are. I'm just going to Drug shut up now before I foul tasting. Foul tasting? Did you taste the Draugr? Yeah, because she tasted death. She might be one of the Hall of the Dead, yeah. Alright, let's uh, get out our bow. Yeah. So, again with his father. We're with five people now. We lost one follower, so f yeah, it makes it five, I think. And uh, I, I just counted Fyotra she, uh, down because she's not a death lord already. Jeez. All right. Let's see if we can apply some poison. Someone is uh, conjuring a, a flame atronach. Conjurer's Drought, Conjurer's Potion, Deadly Paralysis Poison? That's a good one. We better don't miss it though. Okay, let's, let's aim it good. Uh, I, I don't think we need to aim it at him though. Let's try it at the second one. Yes, that's a hit. It's a Scourge, so they're quite tough as well. I think my team is doing a good job of uh, killing it for me again. Your Eola's potent flame atronach, all right. All right, they uh, took care of it. I helped out a little bit. Ebony sword, orcish arrow, yes. The ebony sword, yeah, we were using that already. And I think, I think Sophia is using one of those as well, right? You are, right? That was the uh, flame, Etronach. Let me show you your weapon. Mm -hmm. I'm not sure if I can tell that from the, only the sheath. Maybe. Maybe we can. Yeah, it kind of looks the same. So let's assume she has that weapon already. 
Have you won all right, by the way? Where's Eola herself? Okay, she's a little bit further. It's not really that bad. Um, we should keep an eye out on our health. I'm not sure if we can heal her. We don't have any uh, healing spells for others, I think. One of the supple Nord bows, huh? Quicksilver. I need silver, not quicksilver. And you can keep that, alright. Alright, right, right, right. What are you? She's a shouter, or he is a shouter. Actually, fighting on the front line, but that's not very healthy for me again. Um, so let's take a, a weak healing potion if you got some, or just a, a regular one is fine by now as well. Now let's not get hit again because uh, let's actually back out a little bit and heal ourselves. Okay, more are coming. All right, if anybody else can come. It's another Scourge and a Frost Atronach. It's probably not ours. It resisted the Frost Breath because, of course. All right, let's actually select something else than the Frost Breath. Maybe, um, oh, we should use the Rift Bolt more often. Maybe a slow time won't be so bad to use. Good work, people. All right, Eola is still uh, well. I don't see your uh, health bar over her head. And another synergy point. I would love to know what I can do with that. Because I don't know. All right, so there are tough enemies in here. Draugr, uh, Death Lords and Scourges and whatnot. There's probably... A Draugr boss at the end. I admire your courage. Most folk in Skyrim wouldn't go near a place like this. <laughs> Did you see me fight though? I'm very dependent on you guys. On legendary at least. But thanks for the compliment. Okay, this got traps written all over it. <laughs> it would be nice if they would like come back out alive or something. Like they would crawl out. Crawl out of their holes. It's a little bit of Dark Souls in here. It reminds me a bit of it. Alright. We're definitely not staying in there. Let's uh, go for the sneak damage if we can. And let's put a headshot in your head. It's a white. Apparently we're uh, strong enough to kill a white by now. We do make a quite a good team. To the left. Or to the right. Let's avoid the burial urns. We have plenty of money. I'm still yes, you're still here. We're very glad you're here. Alright, decisions, decisions. I, I think this is going to lead us down. And this is... So let's stay up if we can. Okay, we can pick some enemies off here. And we can actually make a jump for that chest. It's trapped though. What was that? Oh, white. Alright, I think my uh, companions will take care of that. Let's see who else is down here. It seems to be like nobody's down here. Oh, there's plenty of down there. Three enemies. Oh, another frost at Ranak. Alright, that's one down. Is that a white or is it it's another scourge? Let's see if we can hit it. I can help out a little bit here. We're still fighting the white. Ah, okay, I think that there's another though. Oh, 
Wait a second. Did we conjure you? Aeolus Dragor White. Ooh, she is a conjurer. Because she was from the Hall of the Dead. Good. So the Dragor White is uh, coming to go with us. Alright, let's try to make this jump. If we don't make it, I'm going to reload. Probably. Should we sprint for that? Nah. Ooh, barely made it. Okay, let's uh, beware of that trap. Oh, she is going to get... Okay, let's... Let's take that trap for her. I don't want her to get hurt. Not sure if this kills us. And I'm still... <laughs> I'm Can still jumping you? out of the way, but they seem to be alright. Alright, just 18 gold though. Alright, can you... Shit, we're actually a little bit hurt here. We've stopped. What is... Yeah, I needed to use some potions. If you guys can... Please step out of the way a little bit. What can I help you? Then I can uh, join you over there. I guess it's not that bad if we fall down. We've stopped. What is it? follows to the death. All right. They will all follow me to the death. Alarm for 131 seconds alerts you when an enemy crosses the 150 foot perimeter. I can tell you that is not vanilla. Uh, that's not a vanilla spell at all. Wow, you really have to be um very good at being mage to actually do something with this. Alert you when an enemy crosses the 150 foot perimeter. How do I set up a perimeter then? Interesting. Maybe uh, with my Hearthfire mod. Or it's not really a mod, it's a plugin. It's a uh, DLC where you can build your own house and base. And maybe there is some kind of perimeter you can set up. Um, but I don't have that yet. But let's learn it anyway. Now I have alarm. I can set the alarm. Who put on the candles? I, I didn't know Draugr's could, could lit candles. Did you do it? Oh yeah, I guess you guys fell down. Thank you. What's a wampus? Please elaborate. Uh, probably nothing up there, right? Alright. There's a little bit of fog in here. That tomb to the left? It seems not to be empty yet. Oh yeah. What was that? Come on, yeah, it's just a regular one. It's a little bit of overkill, but alright, it works. Poison. And a soldier magicka poison of potion. Yeah. Yeah. Although the rings might be good, but yeah, then again, probably not um, enchanted rings. Potion of pickpocketing, didn't really need that. Some helmets and books. The Doors of Oblivion. It's a skill book, just on a stack of books. Conjuration and we almost leveled up, but not quite yet. So we're almost level 30, I think. I hope that when I die, I don't end up as a shambling corpse. <laughs> Do you suppose the Draugr are angry because we disturb their sleep? I know how they feel. I would also be pretty angry. But uh, to answer the first question, we don't, we can't influence it. We can only protect him. It's like the Walking Dead in here. We'll shoot you through the head if we got a gun. Who did that? You did that, huh? Or maybe I did that. All right. What does this thing do? It closes the door. Now we're cl closed? No? Let's open it up again.
Thank you, healing potion. Don't like the look. Yeah, it, it does look a little bit shady. Wait, 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 wait. Does this open if we close the other one? Let's see if we can actually... Yeah. I think they'll spawn, right? Goodbye, Sophia. It doesn't work like that, though. I I'm thought maybe on. the other one would open up, but maybe that's the exit if we're done with this uh, dungeon. Maybe. Can I help you? Yeah, probably. Ooh, they're ready. Ready to fight. Alright, you're getting some venom. I think. Let's drop the four sword arrow. Some frostbite venom? You're a scourge. And that's a headshot. Okay, that might be a death lord. Ooh, and there's something very bad at there as well. A death overlord, jeez. That does sound bad. Alright, we, we do have to do something more um, destructive, maybe. What scrolls do we have right now? They're probably not uh, up to level 8, right? Cyclonic Rift. Frozen Orb. Yeah, we could use that. I'm not sure if it's also hurting my uh, companions, but it looks cool. What else do we have? It's fun. Fun, fun scrolls. We, I should become mage. Scroll of Hysteria, Scroll of Herring Dirge, Last Word, Raise Zombie, yeah we could raise a zombie, what the hell, why not? Oh shit, um, we should actually point that to on a death zombie, okay the Dragor Overlord is dead and we get to final blow. And we leveled up. Good. Everyone lives, right? I think. Level up. Yeah, we'll do that. Speak to Eola. We'll do that as well in a second. Let's level up first. Hmm. Let's up our st stamina a bit. Destruction. Maybe. It's 41. But I think I want to invest in heavy armor a little bit. Because we are using um, the heavy armor boots right now. Yeah, increases heavy armor. Heavy armor. Yeah, let's do it once. It's it's a very all round perk um, uh, perk journey I'm taking. Um, it's pretty spread out the points I've invested so far. But it's all right. It's all right. Yeah, they're all leveling up. Good for them. You've done it. The shrine is ours again. Another quest. Now we need to prepare a grand feast to welcome you to Namira's coven. You will have the honor of bringing a fresh kill for the main course, and I know the perfect person. Is she a vampire? I think she's just a cannibal. Who is it? I guess we're doing evil. A priest filled with the taste of an easy life. Brother Verilus from Markarth. Give him this gold. Tell him you need Arcae's help exploring an old cavern for treasure. And when he stands in Amira's presence, she will take care of the rest. So we're to Verilus for me. Pleasing Amira, convince Verilus to follow you. I know Verilus. He gave me another quest, I think. We could kiss her. 
because we're so glad to to be with her, but let's just talk. Bring Verilis here. The Lady of Decay will do the rest. Yes, the Lady of Decay. That sounds wrong. But, um... It's the quest, you know? We gotta do it. Unless we have a choice in the quest. Any secrets? I'm just... I can't... I can't contain myself to, to look. Many used to come to these caves. The Forgotten. The Wretched. It looks quite cool, I gotta admit. The My Death Overlord. Ebony Shield. Damn. Alright. Ebony War Axe. 29. It's not that decent. Prefer it boiling. I think we have better weapons. Uh, I'm going to look at that shield though. I am carrying a light shield. That is the glass shield. It does have better armor rating than the ebony one but uh Borgak, what can i do for you friend what do you use what do you need belrand is already sitting at the table like uh, the decent man he is it's 29 though your glass mace is not it's barely better than the axe Um, I'm looking at the shield. Yeah, I have a better shield for you, my orc, orcish friend. There you go. All right. Good. What can she, I do for you? She likes it. You're using the wabachek, but you're also what using something help? else. So let let me give you that axe for now. Can I help? Taller. Because uh, still here, of course. I think you're using something very weak currently. Yeah, a steel sword. Because you you're you don't want to use the wabajack at all. It has an unpredictable effect, you know, Belrand. Thirty-two damage. Yeah, you're, you're going to use the War Axe. That's going to be your weapon. Good. Lead on, then. You're not going to use it now? Wait, 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 wait. Did I give it or did I just equip it on myself? I wouldn't be surprised. No, I think we're good. Well, let's drop this steel sword. Be careful. <laughs> Can I help you? You're telling me to be careful? Yeah. She wants, uh, she wants all, us all to survive this quest, so we can do Namira's bidding. Can I help you? Everyone is sitting down on a table. Iron boots and the boss chest with an elven shield contained in it. We don't need it. Ice spike. A spike of ice does 30 points of frost damage. That's what Sophia is using all the time. So let's immediately learn that. I guess we could, instead of using the um, the fire, the flames, we could use the ice spikes. But I'm probably not going to use it uh, in my favorites just yet. We learned it though. Where's the shouting wall? There's no dragon wall in here. What do we have here? Some books. Some giant urns. Anything? Is there anything of interesting? No, they're all empty. I think this is where Varula has to lie down and we need to offer her him. Um, let's take a look at that quest. So we finished the other quest. No, we didn't finish. There are two quests now. In their footsteps. I've heard a rumor that a vigil of Stendar caravan has been attacked on the road somewhere in the reach. I should investigate. Search for the vigil of Stendar caravan. How the hell did that activate itself? Did Aeola tell something? Did my followers mention something? <laughs> I thought it was like, okay, this is going to be the next quest. But it's still it's still going. Um, a rumor in my head, maybe? I've seen a lot of uh, Vigilance of Stendar dead on the road, though. All right. So we're done here for now. We need to present her with... Uh, so Eola is going to stay here. 
it might take a while before I get back, but you're going to be all right, right? Yeah, all right. I'll see you later then. Um, okay, we can use the other exit now, or passageway at least. Does this lead to an additional exit? Yeah, it does. It does actually. With gold and more gold. Have you ever woken up in the morning with a big cock in your ear? Let's jam it. Every morning. <laughs> no, not really. All right, so um, I guess it's time to choose a next destination. Do we uh, leave on top of the cliff? Reach cliff secret entrance. That is the is that the uh, so-called Japanese bridge we saw before? Yeah, probably. That's probably it. No, no. Where the hell are we? We are currently over here. Wow, we, uh, that's totally different entrance. Huh, this is where the uh, Vigil Standard Caravan is. So that is a different bridge altogether. I guess we'll check it out. What that's going to be next time, people. Um, Interesting quest, interesting um, state of events. Anyway, I guess this is goodbye again and um, stay tuned.